So, today's video is, like I said, the bear crawl challenge or test. So we're going to do a reaction video. What? A mo- what the fuck? Oh my god, no! Is it a max distance doing a bear crawl? This guy did a mile bear crawl in 62 minutes! Oh my god! What the fuck have I got myself into? Hey, what's up you guys? How are we and what is going on? As you can see in the background, I've got some... Well, I've got something on the wall, which is pretty exciting. And behind me, believe it or not, I'm going to give you one look, one look only. This is going to be the only time. We've actually got a scratch map. Uh, I don't know if you can see, but there's very few countries on that map um, scratched out. So I suppose one of my goals, one of my big goals for 2020, is to scratch off a couple more of those countries. And if you don't know what couple of countries I'm talking about, well, you haven't been listening hard enough, have you? Look, guys, we're back for another Rugby Player Reacts video. Today's video, we're continuing with the fitness tests um, that I have been creating a video series called Rugby Player Versus, um, or Rugby Player Tries. I'm not actually sure what it's going to be called yet. Probably the title that, that has the best click-through ratio, or CTR, um, possible because you want people to see your video at the end of the day. So, uh, with all that being said, today we're continuing with that series. I've had two suggestions from multiple subscribers, so I won't shout you out, because I've been told this by more than one person for each of these tests. And the two tests are the bear crawl test and the Murph. The bear crawl test is to do with rugby or football. I'm not sure. Maybe both. Uh, the second, which is the Murph, is a CrossFit workout. Uh, it's a CrossFit workout that I was going to do back in 2017 when I joined a CrossFit box for the first time, but I never ended up doing it. I think it was on a Saturday and everyone came down, had a bit of a competition, bit of a barbecue at the end. Great day out. I didn't go. So I haven't done it. And I can't exactly remember what was in it. So today, first of all, we're going to look at the, uh, the Bear Crawl Challenge. And following that, we're going to look at the Murph. So sit back, relax, get your beverage of choice, and let's get into this. It's absolutely bloody freezing here at the moment, guys, and I'm going to put on this, which is a scarf that my mum got me. Sorry, that's not how you do it. Last time I wore a scarf was in bloody high school, Kashmir High School. It was a fashion statement, believe it or not. White shirt, black scarf. We got told off for wearing it. High school, eh? Just backwards. Anyways, guys, I'm going to continue like this <laughs> because when I do get outside to try this myself, it's going to be about two degrees. So, anyways, let's go. Wow. Yeah. Swear to God, I'm with it. I don't see nobody in my lane. Is quite go get it like me. Wow. Please don't be wasting my time with that business. Who are you kidding, man? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, today's video is, like I said, the bear crawl challenge or test. So we're going to do a reaction video. What? A mo- what the fuck? Oh my god, no! Is it a max distance doing a bear crawl? This guy did a mile bear crawl in 62 minutes! Oh my god! What the fuck have I got myself into? Okay. One mile bear crawl challenge. Holy shit. I did not expect that. I had no idea what to expect, but I definitely didn't expect that. Um, okay. MV Virtual Field Day 2020. Now, for some reason, even though it's only got 163 views, I feel like this guy's going to explain what the bear crawl challenge is. And that's what we need. Really? So how it's going to work, you're going to have five cups that are spread out about one to two feet apart in a nice straight line. And you're going to see how many laps you can complete. So how a lap works is it's going to be a bear crawl down the last cone, and then you're going to zigzag run in and out of the cones on the way back. When you get back to the first cone again, that equals one lap. Your score is going to be how many laps you complete at the end of one minute. So you'll need to either have a stopwatch that you set for one minute, Okay, so that's a one-minute bear crawl challenge. Let me get onto Google. 
I'm assuming that uh, there's a fair few different bear crawl challenges. But this is how to do a bear crawl. Press your palms firmly, firmly into the ground, tuck your toes and hover your knees. Move your left hand and right foot forward at the same time. Then move your right hand and left foot forward at the same time. Continue moving forward and challenge yourself to move backwards. What is the bear crawl good for? The bear crawl is a fundamental total body exercise that can rehabilitate and strengthen your shoulder joints. Develop the core and leg muscles and improve cardiovascular conditioning. Take small synchronized steps keeping your knees directly beneath your body and not reaching too far forward with your hands. Bear crawl challenge. LoveSweatFitness.com You've got to crawl before you can walk and walk before you can run. We all start somewhere and this week we're starting and this week we all start somewhere and this week we're starting together with a bear crawl challenge. One of the... Mm, are you really going to be able to tell me? Right, well what's the challenge? Your best bear crawl. No, we don't want that. Extreme Fitness Challenge Otago Daily Times from Wednesday the 12th of December 2012 uh, recently a friend asked me what I like to what I think about on my drive to workouts like do I feel anxious or wonder why the hell I'm up this early torturing myself Here was, here's what I think about absolutely nothing I know the workout will be tough it always is and I'm good with that so I don't have to waste energy thinking about that part of it um, right bear crawls no there's no 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 this is not giving it this is not giving us our test. The 2020 Bear Crawl Challenge. By good morning. Oh, good morning. December 30th, 2019. You're ready to work on the uh, fitness challenge for 2020. The goal for this year is to do a crawl, a minimum of 10 minutes. Not all at one time. You can do it at 30 seconds intervals. Minute intervals, whatever, by the end of the day, you've been crawling for 10 minutes. That is the overall goal. Okay. I like it. I like you. But that's not the challenge. Okay, we've got bear crawl challenges with things on your back. We've got a one mile bear crawl challenge. He's got 150 views. And I'm not sure why, because the thumbnail is on point. Uh, let's have a look. Well, that might be why. <laughs> no, I'm just joking, mate. Because today, I am going to attempt a one-mile bear crawl. Yes, a one-mile bear crawl. Have I done this before? No. Have I done bear crawls? Yes, I have. But I've not done it this distance. I've done it in classes. We're going to see. I don't really have anyone filming for me today. I've been asking friends if they want to come down and help me out. Don't think they're going to be able to, so I'm going to try and get as many good angles as I can. Just me filming. Bro. <laughs> I was going to say, this is, I was going to say, I feel like this guy, when I go down to the field by myself, you know, no, no cameraman, just trying to do whatever you can. And to be, to be quite fair guys, let me just get a, a still shot. That says a Valbon EF51. And I'm just looking at my tripod, it looked exactly the same, but it's not, it's an M45. <laughs> Oh no, not a good start. Not a good start. So is that his local rugby club? Well that's interesting. Seeing as this video is titled Rugby Player Reacts to the Bear Crawl Challenge. Okay. Actually, like so. I hit. Wow, you know what? I've 
been frustrated countless amounts of times being down at the field trying to run around and track myself with my phone using the GPS and it always falls out of my pocket or it falls down my you know tights or you know I just it just doesn't work it's it's uncomfortable but I've never actually considered actually taping it to my body so that it's solid that's a bloody good idea or I could just get a holder of course of some sort but I've never I've never done that a mile bear crawl challenge now I just saw before that someone took 60 minutes to do that I'm fairly certain that you're gonna have to take some sort of break so let's see one mile so that's 16 times up and down the rugby field Hang on, was that his phone to film the workout? Is that what he's doing? Is he making it? Is he making a make? Is he is he doing a makeshift uh, GoPro? One length, a hundred meters. Right. Third length. Okay. Okay, we've got <laughs> length twelve. Let's have a listen. It almost feels like he's a point of view grasshopper. The rain's about to come again. 15th one. Let the war balls over there. We're on this side. Where all the cars are. One last length. And we've done a mile. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> All right, give us a time. My wrists are a bit. We're about to hit a mile. That's the thing. Your wrists. Your wrists. Fuck. We've done it. Woo! How long? And my legs are in peace. Go after it. Work hard. Push. Even in conditions like this, when it's cold, you want to stop. This is why I've done this today. I knew the weather wasn't going to be the best. About the quality uh, of this video, some of the angles might not have been the best. But again, I'm doing these challenges. I'm showing you. Just push yourself. Just push yourself. And the time that I finished, I started at 1 o'clock. The time is 2.55. Interesting. This guy, this guy is doing great things. You know, he doesn't care how many views he's got. This is exactly the, the attitude you need. He, he literally does not care. He just enjoys creating content, and I can tell. And all I've got to say, mate, is just keep uploading. But what we've got is our first actual uh, time to jot down. So, 1 hour 55 minutes. Right. We've got the Bear Crawl Challenge 1 minute, which is up and down with the cones. And then we've probably got a Bear Crawl Challenge of, of 10 minutes. You know what I mean? 10 minutes to go as far as you can. So, I guess we've got three different... Three different bear crawl challenges that we can attempt. Uh, but what I do want to see is just some more times here. Oh, right, here we go. So this is the five minute bear crawl challenge. Hey guys, we are not Brian Sam. Hey guys, we are not to do the bear crawl challenge. Levi, we're not just going to try and beat the summer for the last time. What was it, 10? How many 20 yard bear crawls can you do in five minutes?
okay, the guy at the front's efficient. He's kicking ass! That is not... That is not going to be easy. Right, how, how many did they get? The five minute, hang on. Uh, five minutes, 20 yards, how many times? Fourteen. Right guys, uh, that looked like fun. And we're gonna go for the 10 minute fitness crawl challenge. I bet, I bet you can't do this workout, he says. His name is Pat Flynn. He's got 20,000 subscribers. Let's give him a listen. And I bet you can't do this workout. One thing I, one thing I always like to do is you know, for a video that's of decent quality, you, you want to see, you really want to see if they're continuing to upload. And it seems as if he's had three months off. I'm Pat Flynn, and I bet you can't do this workout. Let's have a, let's have a look. Let's go, Patty. that you've ever tried. Crawling. So the 10 minute crawl test comes from my friend Tim Anderson of Original Strength and he describes it as daunting but doable. Now what's great about crawling is it is accessible to everyone. You don't need to have a lot of technical proficiency to learn how to crawl. You just have to understand it. Crawling variations you can use for this challenge are of course the bear crawl and the bear crawl is where you move opposite arm and leg together. Bear crawl is where your butt is high in the air and your legs are close to locked but not completely locked. The second variation is the leopard crawl and that's the same pattern but now your knees are as close to the ground as you can make them and your butt is essentially in line with your shoulders. The third variation is the Spider-Man crawl which is perhaps the most challenging variation and your goal with this is to get your knees to the outside of your elbows with every step. I don't think I'll be able to do that for longer than 30 seconds? So now that we understand some of the fundamentals of crawling, let's get into the heart of the challenge, which is to crawl non-stop for 10 minutes. This is a serious challenge. Chances are you are not going to be able to do it. That's why it's an I bet you can't do this workout. Now let me just give you one tip. Don't crawl in the same direction the entire time. Go forwards, backwards, side to side. This is how you're going to get that little bit of rest that you need to make it through the entire time. Really? Minutes. I would Check not have out. thought that. Okay, so we have Alyssa and Glenn with me, and we are going to show you a few different crawling variations that you can use for this challenge. Ready? No. To the, the I bet you can't do this workout challenge is to prove me wrong. So what I want you to do is use the hashtag I bet you can't do this workout and let me know by posting on either Instagram, Facebook, or YouTube if you completed the 10 minute crawl challenge. I'm Pat Flynn, this has been The Pat Flynn Show, and we will see you on the next episode. It's time to eat. Bro, if you don't show us your result, then why the fuck did we even watch that? Right, one mile challenge. Let's see what this guy gets. Originally completed Christmas Eve, 2012. It sucked. I can't fully extend my wrist. Oh my god. That is gonna suck. But I did it. I don't know if it's worth it. Once you start, don't quit. That's it. Till next time, you stay strong, stay positive. Be the improvement warrior today. Later.
12 down. 46, 10. We got four more to go. Shit, okay, so he's going a lot faster than the other guy. That's 100 meters down there. <laughs> Imagine how you'd feel on the last one. Imagine that. Ohio State! 62-33. Alright. I think we've seen enough. So there you go. That was Rugby Player Reacts to the Bear Crawl Challenge. And it seems as if these are the final numbers. Well, the final uh, takeaways from this video, you could say. The Bear Crawl is done multiple ways. The Bear Crawl Challenge is done in multiple ways. There is a one minute all out challenge uh, where you, you know, will make your way around a certain course in as many times as possible in one minute using the Bear Crawl. There is a five minute challenge or a 10 minute challenge where you can use a 20 meter or 20 yard distance and go up and down as many times as possible. Or you can use 10 yards, it's up to you. I guess you could call that 100 meter sprint, you know, a 1500 meter race. Now we're talking about the marathon. Okay, this is, uh, this is gonna test you. And this is a one mile bear crawl, which is 1600 meters. We had one guy complete it in an hour and 55 minutes. We had another guy complete it in 62 minutes and 33 seconds. So from that, I would assume that going well, you'd want to get under an hour. And if you're going to go for the 5 minute or 10 minute MRAP, the only score that I actually jotted down was they did 14 laps of 20 yards in 5 minutes. And if my calculations are correct, that is 280 yards in 5 minutes. But I feel like the challenge I'm going to do first, or maybe I should do all three. In fact, you know what, I'm going to have to think about that. But in the meantime, guys, Enjoy whatever content is coming. I don't know exactly what video is going to come. Neither do you. No one knows what video is going to come on this channel because if you have a look at the, the front page, I've got playlist after playlist after playlist. And it's so awesome because when I do upload a video, it's definitely going to be, you know, associated with one or more of those playlists. So I upload the video, I tick whatever playlist I want it to be included in, and then it's up to the viewer. You know what I mean? So playlists are definitely the way that I would, I would recommend anyone out there to navigate their way through my channel. And with all that being said, I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day, guys, and peace out.